their hand, their stocking cap. Oh. Oh. Every Thursday we have craft day here at the church and everyone is welcome to come. And we are continuing working on hats for heroes and these are the hats we send over to Landstuhl, Germany for the wounded, also hats for children and the people in Afghanistan. We send them to the soldiers and they distribute the hats. When they're wounded they don't have time to pack a suitcase before they come and so Jim wanted hats and gloves and scarves for them and once again I talked to Bernie about it and Boy, we had hats and gloves and scarves just going over there quickly. A special thanks to Lieutenant Jim Wiley, who's no longer with us, that he started this. He's the one that made us aware of the needs. We were not. We did not know that our soldiers needed stump covers to cover their amputated limbs and that they needed hats to wear when they went outside to have a cigarette. I try to make a monthly visit, and it's probably eight boxes that go out on a monthly basis with hats and items, yeah, so they see me coming. <laughs> it's such a gift to us as well as to them because they have given so much and we give so little. But these soldiers are so receptive to anything. Yeah.